Tarawa State was created 33 years ago, precisely on the 27th day of August 1999. Like every other state in the country, as each year passes by, there are expectations of growth and development to show for such progress. At 33, how far has Tarawa State fared? These analyses we will bring to you here at each lined up series of the different spheres of state development as Taraba State Clocks 33. <laughs> On this Medin edition of the Countdown, let's listen to Taraba State Chairman of the Nigerian Union of Journalists Comrade Matthew Eddy Jen give insights on the development of the fourth estate of the REM in the state, 33 years now. So far, so good. I don't expect that uh, a child of 32 will be calling me. Please, crawling. File the fifth stage. The journey has been. Got it yes, yes, and the good, the bad, and the ugly. The good of the journey is the fact that uh, when it's covered, uh, it's covered at least Arab State has tried. So, uh, I went to other places and I saw uh, the stadium compared to what we have here, and I said, <laughs> this, this state has done <laughs> The expertise that came the other time on their assessment, Dubai, they said that uh, this hospital uh, actually uh, hospitals in and uh, on the education uh, the this that you discover that reason our state is on the news all over that uh, His Excellency primary school the state have free uh, I mean the free tuition for, for, for students secondary primary and tertiary institutions in the state. And this is a commendable development. Before now, you discover that others are uh, just uh, all in the streets. And uh, uh, with this government, at least we have seen that happen. And then with, uh, within the civil service, uh, we discover that within this area, at least the hue and cry about uh, other states not being paid for, for months. It's not witness in Taraba State. Uh, right now, uh, after the implementation of the Taraba Salary, uh, before now, and even right now, uh, the governor of Taraba State, uh, that he's going to implement the 70% right away. So you discover that uh, the infrastructure, I mean, the uh, human development, that's we are not there. But uh, coming to industrial progress, actually we are lagging behind uh, with the plethora of uh, mineral resources here and there. We discovered that these mineral resources remain on that. And it's just recently that uh, you see the efforts coming from the Board of Internet Revenue. They still have put somebody there and uh, effort is being made oh, yes, to ensure yes. that industries are created oh, yes, yes. for these things to happen. So, uh, so we believe that uh, maybe yeah. not this yeah. time yeah. date, I think uh, we are yeah. going to hear yeah. a few yeah. stories in the areas of industrial uh, progress. Yeah. I was chatting with uh, Elijah. the yeah. top yeah. management yeah. of internal revenue say that uh, the yeah. state generated about 98 what was expected of it which means it, it, it rose from about 25% to 98 I think this is a commendable uh, development 
So, Tarabat is going somewhere. And, uh, when you go through the, the, the roads, if somebody is visiting uh, and you are back to Tarabat, then you go to praise uh, the, uh, the, the Jesus for putting in their best to ensure that our some of, most of the roads are tired. But as the much as they left the town, uh, we are calling on government to do more in the area of infrastructure and, development. and uh, also in the area of human relations, particularly as it affects relations uh, uh, with the uh, unions and journalists in the state also, and there should be some kind of improvement because of recent I discovered that some of these there were as a kind of stalemate. So within this period, I think Karabati is doing well. So when you look back a little bit, you, you discover that maybe there is a kind of lacuna that was created recently, which of course must have been as a result of something that is happening. Like like you say, I know the thing. But when you look back a little bit, uh, the last administration, when uh, the state impact on the um, periodic press chats in the state. I think it was periodic. And uh, things that are happening in the state at that time, it, it, you know, the journalists were abreast of them. There was no question of whether the government was dropping in the dark. Uh, but recently, actually, there were complaints coming from some quarters. So I want to believe that we've been able to discuss with the, the top management uh, those concerned as chairman and during of journalists. I've been able to, I, I was able to sit with uh, some of these people and I want to believe very soon this type of thing should be a thing of the past. Uh, all, uh, we, 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 we all realized um, uh, our failures and our successes. And, uh, and potentials. Uh, and our potentials. Sharing, sharing information. Very difference. good. Uh, sharing information, of course. And um, I will not uh, lend in saying that there are still uh, some bad things within the system. Uh, we know that there are some journalists who would like to throw the ethics to the wing. Uh, you know, by not balancing. Uh, I think we should do well to see that situations where things happen, the money. we as much as possible balance our stories so that we give uh, what do I call it? The you populace, know, the, the confidence. Yeah, the we give confidence uh, to the populace because we are worst dogs of the society and uh, we don't expect a situation where uh, somebody feels that uh, you are working for another person. At least the journalist being fourth estate of the room we stand as a body, we stand for ourselves, you know, and then we will report exactly what we see. We call this fair spade. So, in a situation where somebody is doing the contrary, I think um, something is said to be wrong somewhere. Thirty-three years is a period of uh, honestly, it's a period of grace in one's life because by the time you pass twenty-five and you are still there. Uh, your parents will start uh, saying, uh -huh, can't you think uh, about settling down? So somebody who is 33 is a period of grace. So I want to say to Tarabans, Cheerio. I want to say to Tarabans, happy celebration. At least we are moving. And uh, with time, I know, uh, Tarabans did to make a name and uh, join the Committee of Other States in Industrial and Economic Development. As well as that political development also. Thank you so much, sir. Thank you. Well, that was the chairman of the NUJ in Tarawa State, Comrade J, speaking about the media journey in the state, 33 years gone and many more counting. We do hope, as he said, the journey gets better. In all, we have cause to celebrate. Hooray! as Taramba State hits 33. Join us for our next intriguing series of the ZT News Countdown of Taramba State at 33.
I'm your sincerely, Queen Kundi. See you again in a short while.